minutes later, I lay down and passed out. <clears throat> Dave. Dave. Welcome back. No. You spill beer on your shirt. Oh. I thought you were doing the jack-off motion. No, that's this. This well, is, hey, dumbass. Like... This is me doing this. Start jacking off my hair like that. I thought you were yes, lying. Yes, Trying yes. to be a liar and insinuate you like a horse cock. God no. Jesus Christ. What for the limp it was that day? Uh, <laughs> I'm almost ready. Just There we go. <clears throat> oh, there's a 20 in there. Cool. So, what has happened to us? Okay, so you arrive in Here this fucked. fairly large chamber. Chamber. Sitting Secrets. in the far corner. And. What is, thus far anyway, as far as this place goes, the uh, largest show of wealth is uh, sitting a Minotaur, surrounded by ladies of actually varied races. There's a couple of tieflings. There's you don't discriminate. A, there's a dwarf. There's a couple of humans. I really don't uh, discriminate. There's even a few, like, halflings and gnomes. <coughs> They are, they are not wearing very much. Cool. They naked, Dave. <clears throat> and the boobies. The uh. The shorter they are, the bigger they seem. <laughs> Red mark. You better have a good reason for interrupting me. Yes, sir. Uh, we have new people in the waste. <laughs> new people here to test their metal. <laughs> <laughs> what do we do with the metal? And you can't kill the metal. Ah, Punk Rock tried to kill blood. the metal, but they failed. Perhaps you may wish to join us. New way to try. When you are finished. We never know. He's asking us to join his. Well, and he has, like, he's giving us an offer. He also has the, like, body paints and everything. Uh, it's not as concise because he has fur. <laughs> so, yeah. And that kind of makes things a little trickier to paint on. <clears throat> I am Minrock, truth speaker. M I N R A K. <sighs> so you wish? Perhaps not a wish. More like forced. So you are here. See if you're worthy of the least. Miguel. Fantastic. What are your names? <coughs> I am Kyron. Introduce yourself, stupids. And Soren. And Dave. Dave? I just say it. That's Maybe Rand. A, not in any way, like. Right, but give me a deception check. What do I have in deception? <coughs> I will have it. Stands up, all the ladies fall off of him. He's a big dude. Like, he's probably. Well, I'm only like four feet tall. I know. So. <laughs> You're less than four feet tall. Yeah. Um, he, he stands about 15 feet tall. You're about a fifth of his size. I've made a huge mistake. <laughs> all pun intended. <laughs> He uh, kind of reaches out. He's big. 
and this uh, this this great axe appears in his hands. Just shows up. Yeah. That's and a good really trick, senor. He's gonna beat you to death with it. <sighs> well, I believe looks like we need a new halfling. I believe or maybe they'll make him a fourth one. Can we just find the other half? <laughs> Yes, uh, maybe that's I, the half of the brain. You may have misheard. My my name is Rand, Rand Brightbottle. At your service, sir. <laughs> oh, I was kind of hoping he'd turn him into a fourth link. <laughs> <laughs> your metallic dog, as well. I I, Rand gestures. I'm back. How you doing? <laughs> It talks. That's fun. Sky <laughs> talk. You look a little angry there. <laughs> you want to go play? He rests the axe against his shoulder. <clears throat> no longer seeming overtly hostile. You don't want to get angry at Bart. <laughs> yeah, because well, yeah, Bart's literally the happiest thing in the world. <laughs> You have not seen much of the place yet, I would assume. Most visitors are brought immediately to me. Uh, let me see here. From the time frame. Probably right on time. Do you have any preparations you would like to do before? Holding my hand. Huh? Nothing. You yeah, make really? it the same thing at No, yeah. we're going to take care of preparations A through G. So I got to do preparation H. <laughs> Only if you need it. Sorry. But. And also, I have a. Out of character. Out of character. He's going to fuck us with something. He has given us like five chances to prepare for something. Probably shaped and, like this. And, and we've we prepared. I'm prepared. Are you prepared? Can you fight? I just have a feeling like he's going to bend us over and go in dry. What nah, else we'll be do good. I need to do? Like, I, I got nothing else. I, I, I have a bow that shoots elemental damage that I name. We'll get in character. We're ready. Excellent. Um, you kind of leads you, because the door that you came in is Damn. a little too small for him. Across the other side of the room, <clears throat> there is a much larger door that he can get through. He does have to bend a little bit, just because he's so big. <laughs> and uh, <clears throat> he starts leading you through the, <coughs> the section that you went through. Is hmm. the area on the outskirts is dead? That's that is designated for the medium and smaller sized creatures of the pit fiends. Um, as you get progressively further in, like toward the center, the openings become much larger, and you start to see a variety of different creatures, not just humanoids. I mean, you do see a few mm -hmm. giants. And the like. But you also see things like <coughs> centaurs. And. Um, I'm trying to think of big. <laughs> bigger stuff. Um, half dragons. Which are bigger. You, we gathered. <laughs> you even see. A couple of like full dragons, like once you get kind of further in, but they defer. They they seem to be deferring to Minrock, and, and and he kind of like motions to them all, and they all are decorated with this weird like tribal kind of paint stuff. <clears throat> May I? I don't know. Perception investigation. Um, does it look like it's just paint on them, or 
Do you ask yeah, me if they're really a tattoo? Give me a perception check. Okay. It depends on the creature, for one. Not all creatures are capable of being tattooed. Right. 25. If that's perception, yes. Okay. 25. So, the ones that have just flesh, like like the giants and mm. centaurs, and yeah. humans and elves and whatnot, uh, they are tattooed. Okay. At least as far as you can tell. It, it doesn't have the um, layer kind of look that like paint would. Okay. For example. Uh, the furred and scaled creatures are uh, it's painted. Okay. But you notice that in, in all cases some of it is ruined. Like some of some of the, the, the body art has a bit of a glow to it. Okay, so even with like without very much magical perception, I have a little bit, but I can yeah. tell that it glows <coughs> yeah. a little Okay, gotcha. And then you kind of get to the outskirts of what is the arena area. And it is, um, these are cages. You see rows and rows and rows of cages of different types of creatures. In them. And he is walking along, stop it, uh, checking on the like locks on the gates. Mm-hmm. Looking in on, on the creatures, you see um, quite a few. Here. It's back here because that's why that's what they put. They put it in the back of the DM's guide, not the monster. But whatever. <coughs> so. You see a few caged dragons that have that were not really working with them. Uh, you see in a very heavily reinforced cage, uh, also trapped in a rune, you see a Baylor. Um, Those are like 15 feet tall, right? Yeah, or more. They're probably more than that. They're freaking. See several golems, but those aren't in cages. They're just like in in the alcoves, because they don't have to be cages. golems. Are, yeah. yeah, they're just commanded. Does you see, see a purple worm? Yeah. Uh, we we see things that without even having to roll, we realize are very dangerous. Yes. You can see a beholder in one of them. Hey, we could one. Oh. Uh, this beholder, though, you notice has its its central oh, wow. eye. Is like, um, oh, so does not care about this charger? Does it not? Nope. As are all of the eye stalks. And it's kind of like chained yeah. so that it, get, it can't see or use its, its rays. It's like a chain chomp, except with the eyes. With eye stalks, yeah. That's <laughs> kind of what it looks like, yeah. So it's a chain looker. <clears throat> and it comes to this little. This is kind of small. There's no real pun you can make for a vision yeah. thing. It's just, it's just what it is. And standing in there, in there is a. Well, it just looks to be a knight. With, um, but like beneath the helmet, and in <coughs> the sort of eye slit, you see these two glowing red orbs. Where its eyes. You can do if you're interested in what this is. Yes. Um, religion or Arcana? Rand isn't really. Arcana. Sure, why not? Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Fourteen. Fourteen. Rand is still just curious about the general area, but not about anything in particular. Seventeen for him. You got fourteen. Fourteen. Okay. <coughs> he 
He rolled well enough. Huh? Twenty-two is good. Yes, you you have, you've read about this kind of thing before mm -hmm. uh, in in some of your previous studies, um, but you don't know a lot about what this guy is. Just kind of general. Um, this type of individual is called a death knight, the creature, not the playable class. Right. Um, and when a paladin that falls from grace dies without seeking atonement, dark powers can transform the once mortal knight into a hateful undead creature. That's what this guy is. Like a black knight. Yeah, so I like racist. Actually, you cut off one of his arms. The He's still got another. Or like the, the the artwork in here reminds me very much of Dark Souls. <clears throat> okay. Okay. It's this guy. Right One man with a tin can. Huh? A tin can? Not gonna lie. Dark Knight's in. Or the Death Knight's in. Dark Souls might kick his ass though. Yeah. They're it depends on if it's our souls. Uh, depends on if it's before or after the Oh game yeah. idea. We do Dark Souls Star Wars style. Darth Souls. I already played that. What what? Darth? Yeah. I was there, I watched it. Mm-hmm. Seven seven point five out of ten, too much water. Too much too much water. I also want to point out that Dave, when he had the idea, he went like this and held his fingers in front of his nose. Can we continue with this? I do finger guns, okay? Quest into It was the just pit. like, from this angle, you're just like this. I was just like, are you cold? <laughs> uh, uh, but I wasn't like, anyway. So, yeah. Death Knight, Death yeah, Caged. You have a new challenger. No, no, never mind. A group of challengers. New and, challenger approaches. And you hear a start. It's kind of cackling, um, otherworldly kind of laughter. Excellent. I bring my friends. Of course. This is a little kill well. For him. <clears throat> And then you continue down. The Dave, way. give me bosses I've almost killed and somebody else finished off. <laughs> me, which is I, the best threat I can come you up remember with. Remember that <sighs> hey, you killed a boss once. Possibly become once? part of the enemy. Yeah. Nah. I can fix that. Yeah. And now I have another good spell. So you can't jump out of range. He leads you around, <laughs> and you go one more kind of stage. And there is a um, sizable gate that leads into this massive open area. What? <laughs> Good talk. Mm -hmm. So something like his mom's vagina. On the probably other, is like that. On the other side... It spit me out. <laughs> yeah, I know. Your On the big other ass side head. of this arena. Ass head. <laughs> yeah. This is, by the way, a um, hundred feet across, and about, we'll say, seventy feet deep. The, the other way. So it's not a circular pit. It would be an oval. Yes. That is a true statement, sir. That is a true fact. Good. I don't like <clears throat> false news. Fake news? What about alternative mean? truths? Alternate facts. Oh, that's... Yeah, it, you kill them, but you're, you're... That's what I do. You kill them back and forth there. Yeah, that's what I do. I'm not even going to respond to you anymore because he's killing them. Mm -hmm. okay. Murder death. Backstab. Crazed butt stabber. Murder death. Murder death. It's my favorite thing. <laughs> a 
thought she was funny. Yeah, I know. You don't respect her. Ooh. Other than what I just said, of course. And that. And that. Yeah. Got it. Baby, you know, I'll win it. <laughs> <laughs> so, this, this Death Knight dude, you see him on the other side. We'll give me perception checks, because it's pretty far out. Nineteen. Twenty-five. Mm. Fifteen. Awesome. Twenty-five. <clears throat> You'll get the most precise count of this. Cause uh, there are enough. Death Knight is there. And he actually is sort of he's flanked by two of these, and then behind him is another row. Three. Five total. Plus uh, <coughs> There are there are these really kind of thin, emaciated looking creatures. No, they're all co- wrapped up in bindings. Okay. Out of character, mummy ish looking. Yes. Don't know if they are mummies, but mummy ish looking. Okay. Yes, they they're humanoid, they they are very heavily wrapped in bandages. Uh, kind of like Makoto Shishio, if you're familiar with it. Uh, you action. just said syllables. Uh, with what? Yeah. Huh? If you're familiar sure, with sure, what? Sure, 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 but there's, there's Ronnie character Kenshin. I know which one he's talking in, about. In Kenshin okay. called uh, Makoto Shishio. <clears throat> Great anime. I freaking love that one. It's so good! I haven't watched Kenshin yet. Me too. Never watched it. I only like like four anime. Okay. How it starts? Or five. See? I forgot about Gun. Already one. gained one that I forgot about Gun One. How much time do we have? Uh, three minutes. Okay, that actually works out pretty well then. Because I don't know. He said he had to hit sleep. I gotta get to bed soon. So D hmm. two. After I eat a drop one. <laughs> the brain time. My uh, medicine bad. Oh yeah. You also notice up on the um, on the right hand side from where you're facing is a very sizable looking just like seating all over the place. Um, and it's it's very weird because there are sections that have uh, very large seats kind of separated out and then something that's much smaller. Uh, the Minotaur fellow is sitting in the very center on the right hand side in the sort of like uh, private private box kind of thing because he's in the, so he gets, uh, the king's position so to speak and he kind of calls out and this place is full of shit Shit, yeah. All <laughs> kinds of crazy stuff. Uh, you see some undead, like in the crowd. And nobody pays. Uh, no. Because they're all. Attention. They're all tatted up, too. Okay. Um, like, like sentient undead. Not mm. just like zombies. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, like or vamp- just corpses like, sitting in the like, crowd. Like, like, like vampires. But like, you see, of course, Ooh, dragons. Zombies. You see giants. You see. Um, uh, actually, I might need. Oh, I'm bad for Arcana. Do I notice anything? See if you satyrs. Just to know. I. Incorporeal? That I might be able to see? Uh, I don't know roll. if I can even roll for anything like that. Roll it. What do I roll? Dice. Perception. Okay, that I can do at least. In- incorporeal doesn't mean, like, invisible. It, it's like you can't touch them. Okay, so yeah, 20, 30. So, yeah. Uh, yes. There <laughs> are a few ghosts. They also seem to be tatted up, but like, it's it's got it's just like a paler color than them. Okay. Uh, so it, 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 it is noticeable. But there's still that <clears throat> noticeable <clears throat> tattoo yeah. motif. Exactly. And then he says... 
<laughs> that was recent. Ladies and gentlemen. God damn it. There's a wreck at Nitro. Oh, this is. Yeah. If you need oh, caps, we have, we I have, have to some a new I can't. group of individuals <laughs> passing through. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. They will prove themselves <coughs> in the arena. Yeah. <clears throat> the rules are simple. Kill or be killed. Hmm. That is all. Okay. And with that, we will end this session. Yay! <sighs> so, next time, this is going to get very interesting. Next time, we're going to kill things. I don't understand the interesting part. <laughs> next time, we're going to do the things we're good at. Indeed. Uh, Dave, it's what we've been doing every game. We kill things. We kill things. We and then have we, we ever things. peacefully solved any problems without murdering someone? Ever. Uh-huh. Ever. That's right. Never. That's what in the evil campaign we did. Yeah. Yeah. The but evil that's campaign. The evil campaign that yeah. Shut, <laughs> that shut we down were evil we entrepreneurs. I was about to say the evil campaign is less evil than fucking chaos is. I know. That's why it was shut down. And we because don't do somebody it doesn't know how to not put his hands yeah, on yeah, things. Yeah, no worries. Bye, friends. Later. <laughs>